Uh, but you also have that, as I said, it crosses sometimes into CFL fans. Very often you'll find that those that like uh, the uh, National Cross, it also combines with a lot of grassroots guys who are huge CFL fans. Our good friend Jared Harris, who uh, is a part of the Box J Boys, but he supports anything CFL, I'll be honest. Jared is probably one of the most uh, giving people that I've, I've met, and he is part of the CFL fans fight cancer. Now, I know we've got some pictures here that we're going to show, uh, and they have done just the most uh, marvelous job, including... Uh, so, they, so here's what they do, Dave. They go, they go to, like, say, Ottawa, and we have the picture of the... So an actual meeting of where you're supposed to go, they'll talk about a hotel or a bar. Mm -hmm. And then literally, Dave, they go around with almost like a bag... And uh, you put money in it. And then at the end, if there's a hospice or whatever the, the, the center happens to be in that town where it's being held in the Grey Cup, they give them money. And so for this uh, particular event in Ottawa, $15,000, just like that, there's your money for, for your town. That's so it's, awesome. like, it's not a national campaign. It's very, very local. And this is what makes these guys very special. And they do this stuff all the time. They do it in all the towns. And uh, I can't say enough about these guys, what they do. So thanks so much, Jared. Uh, once again, CFL fans fight Keep it cancer. Up. Keep it up. Well done. And part of the Toronto Rock Roadie. Just become best friends. Yep. 